Hello, Canada. For a big country, you're kind of small. You're like this Hello. big. I'm squishing your head. Um, and cut. Gonna kick on back. Peel this label, watch you do your Friday Feelings? Things. Good. No, no feelings at all. Hey guys, uh, we're uh, day four, I think, here in the studio, something like that. And um, this is my favorite part of making a record. But this is the day that uh, we bring in the professionals, the real singers, to, uh, to make me sound better. Uh, the icing on the cake, as it were. Um, Russell Terrell, everybody. Hey. Russell actually sang on my very first record, a um, couple songs on that record. To Be Where You Are and Shine, I believe, were the singles that you sang on, right. which was 11 years ago. I know, right? Yeah. Russell sings on, if you're a fan of um, um, Keith Urban, Josh Turner, some Tim McGraw stuff, Dirk Bentley, uh, Craig Morgan, Dustin Lynch, I think, mm -hmm. uh, Derek Rattan. Um, Derek Rattan. Who am I missing? There's oh, lots, of, lots of other uh, people. Luke Bryan. Luke Bryan. Um, anyway, all those cats. Uh, Derek Rattan, uh, did we mention that one? Watch and learn, kids. I know she could be the answer to some old boy's midnight prayer. But she could be that morning sunshine. One thing that Russell does is he, and I think he's unique in this aspect, when he first goes into the booth to learn what part he's going to sing, he sings a, um, he learns the melody first, so he sings along with the singer. So you'll hear him learning you, the lead singer, here doing the inflections and sort of how the melody rolls, very specific to that singer. And he'll learn that real quick, and then he'll put the harmony on. Yeah. I know she could be the answer to some old boy's midnight prayer. As far as we're going right there, just studying. And I think it, it enables him to to be um, more in tune with the lead vocal and serve the song a little better by uh, by doing that. Do that and just see if I can figure out what's going on there. I just maybe on a different vowel or something. I mean, I'm not I'm not known as the voice behind the voice. <laughs> so you know, it probably it probably is me. Our voices. It might be. It's probably oh. me. But oh, I don't know. Just I'm check sure it out. It huh? I'm sure it is. <laughs> it's gotta be. Well, you. yeah. It's gotta be you. <laughs> One day she'll be a mama to a wife to a man she loves. Yeah. Um, he, he gave me that one easy. It just kind of threw me a bone on that first one. Maybe one more time. Lots. Chipes. Lost chipes. I rarely drink alcohol at lunch. Um, the exception to that rule, of course, being today. Had some, had some red wine. And uh, I've never had to sober up for a recording session before. It's not the 70s, for God's sakes, you know? Only in Tennessee are pets. Does no one bat an eye when I don't know someone's that. pet's name is... Princess Monster Truck. The band doesn't come pick me up, throw me in rehab for two weeks before a recording session. Because Jesse Alexander is um, my favorite female singer in Music City, USA. This is my friend Jesse Alexander, and uh, she and I and our other friend Connie Harrington wrote a song called Mine Would Be You that Blake Shelton cut. It's on his new record. But she's a, she's a true treasure. I mean, there's a lot of people who say this, and I, I would say this if she wasn't sitting here, but this is one of the best, this is my favorite female country singer, mm. bar none. Besides our song that Blake Shelton recorded, she just had a number one record with Lee Bryce called I Drive Your Truck. She wrote that song. Um, she had a number one last year with Drink On It, Blake Shelton um, recorded. And um, another big one was a song called The Climb that uh, uh, Billy Ray Cyrus's daughter, one of them, I forget which one, uh, record Miley, that's it. Miley. Uh, recorded, yeah. Yeah. So anyway, a lot of talent here. Aw, thanks. For those of you who know my first record, self-titled record, there's a song on there called Ashes to Asphalt 
that uh, is the last song on the record, and Jesse sang on that. And uh, and you want me now to sing it? Watch this. It's going to be brilliant because she's got one of those minds, folks. She's got one of those memories for melody. It just all floods back. That's true. And you're about to you're about to is, witness that. The song is so good, right? That's it. The song <sighs> is so you. good. The melody's just. Like it's good. in there somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Standing there in that dust cloud from her spinning tires, staring at the black top. At a fast burning fire, no, this ain't the ending I had planned for us. Ashes to asphalt, dreams to Yeah, that worked. Do you want lyrics? I don't know that I need them, but I'll take them. Oh, this bragger. Is one, this is one I actually it's, know. This is nice. This is two That's good. That's good. I wrote it. Last course. Oh, I, I wrote it too. I still need I, the words. You do? Oh, I can't, I can't keep anything really? in my head. Oh, yeah. Who's making up our own words? Laugh until it hurts. Baby, if I had to choose my best day ever, my finest hour, my wildest dream come true. Yeah. Yeah, that's when I'm going to go up to the fifth. Well, I'll sing this one third, and then I'll give you some options. Okay. Okay. Die there. I don't know if that was it, but that's it. Okay. You, you, you got it. I'm gonna kick on back. Peel this label, watch you do your Friday dance. Pour a little of your favorite something in your glass. Girl, toss it back We could go downtown Meet our friends, check out a band Get good and loud You could put on that red dress Makes my head spin round We could sneak off And take the wheel 